means we get ready to go racing and they are side by side and ready to go it's ta2 powered by aem it's a 45 lap 99 mile race and we are away and look at that like a hair the silver hair man it is off and running great start from rafa matos good start from jp southern he's made up a spot on peterson on uh, cameron lawrence by the looks of things so the youngster the 18 year old jp southern his local race Going well so far, but it's Rafa Matos as we head through the S's for the first time. A good clean start. Everybody in shape now as we look above. And Ben, what a great uh, sound as we go on board with Cameron Lawrence. Oh, it sure is. So glad to be back. The TA2 Racing at Middle House Sports Car Course always puts on a good show. And I've seen that man right there, Cameron Lawrence, do things that nobody should be able to do in a race car. Ben, I know you're going to do the same as me, but it's... Oh, no! Oh, no! Doug Peterson. Doug Peterson comes to a complete grinding halt. Now, he must have slowed down before the start of the race. That is uh, Doug Peterson out of this race as they come on to the front straight again, led by Rafa Matos. Oh, a real shame indeed. But never mind. We go back and you can hear, listen to this, Peterson just puttering. It looks like he's, he's, he's coming in by the power of a starter. Yeah, that's So not he has good. no power. Uh, go into the engine, and he was just coming in with the with the starter. But Thomas Merrill, Mike Skeen, side oh, by side, Jonathan. And the championship leader under pressure from Thomas Merrill, who gets it done. They're side by side. It's a drag race here in Mid Ohio. Merrill trying to get the power down on these big muscle cars, and I think he's got him. Skeen will come back on the outside, but uh, Merrill will have the line going into turn four. And will surely take second place. Well, he has the line now, but if Skeen keeps that oh, line, he's got Skeen's the advantage. Yeah, yeah there right. he goes.